The four-year computer science degree just became optional at 26% of data science companies. 26%, and that's just the beginning. Well, college students are racking up an average of $142,000 in debt, learning theoretical foundations. Hiring managers are quietly rewriting the rules. So are you betting your career on the wrong horse? In my decades of building software and leading tech teams, I'm watching the biggest shift in hiring I've ever seen. Companies are finally admitting what I've known for a little while here, but it's been kind of even a change in my opinion over the last decade. They don't necessarily need your degree. They need your ability to ship working code. Today, I'm breaking down some signs that we're looking at as looking at how experience is crushing education in the hiring game and what this means for your tech career. So let's dive into some of this today. So this is an interesting video for me to make because the me of 10 years ago would have absolutely thrown something at the me of now. The old hiring playbook is dead. While universities are still selling the same education package they did three decades ago, the tech industry has moved on. I've sat in countless hiring meetings where we've passed on computer science graduates and almost never do I see computer science with masters getting hired anymore. And I see them getting hired in favor of this young scrapper who's come along with just a handful of ex, uh, years of experience and a good GitHub repository, right? And so this is one of the things that I'm seeing, that self-taught developers who can build real products and have show real experience are beating those with the, with the diploma, right? So let me walk you through exactly what's happening now and how you can pos position yourself to win in this new landscape. And again, I've shifted my thinking a lot over 10 years ago. 10 years ago, I, I mean, for, for the first 20 years of my career, I counseled a lot of youth, get the degree, get the degree, get the degree, get the degree. Over the last five years, I've really started to see this shift. Now, companies are quietly dropping degree requirements faster than you can update your LinkedIn profile. 26% of data science jobs postings don't even require a degree anymore, and this trend is accelerating across all tech disciplines. I've personally hired developers who never set foot in a computer science classroom, but could code circles around those who have masters and PhDs. The shift happened because hiring managers are realizing that someone who spent four years memorizing algorithms aren't going to necessarily know how to build that using that latest package that you're going to need built. And also, a lot of times their salary requirements are so much higher because they're sitting on a pile of tech debt tech ugh, student debt that's what i was trying to spit out but when i'm evaluating candidates i care more about their github contributions than their gpa and most tech leaders are really starting to think the same way so smart companies are recognizing that practical skills trump theoretical knowledge almost every single time so let's take a look because i'm promise guys i'm not making this up here so this is the wall street journal ai is wrecking an already fragile job market for college graduates companies have long leaned on entry-level workers to do grunt work that doubles as on the job training now now, uh, I hate the word H, but AI and other bots are doing many of those chores. So what do you hire a 20 year old, 22 year old college graduate for these days? Now, I'm going to dive into a couple of these things here because it goes through and talks about some of this and talks about where graduates hiring has gone over the last few years. So they say there, there's been an unwritten covenant between companies and new graduates and entry level employees, young and hungry are willing to work hard for lower pay. Employers in turn provide training and experience to give younger professionals a foothold in the job market, seeding the workforce of tomorrow. Now, this is kind of one of my biggest problems here, guys. I think a lot of this is fairly short sighted. And I'm going to talk about what Startup Pack is doing because we are doubling down on going against this trend in a lot of ways. So it's saying AI is accelerating the trend. And you know, as if you've been following my videos, I'm definitely an AI realist. I'm not saying AI is running out there and stealing every job, but we are seeing percentages and uh, movements towards um, towards seeing some of this, you know, some impact on this, right? So sectors where graduate hiring is slow the most, like information, finance, insurance, and technical services are still growing, a sign that employees are becoming more efficient and seeing no immediate downside for hiring fewer inexperienced workers. So, um, and so we're seeing, you know, like the employers are trying to work on and, and really push efficiencies, right? Now, after dancing around the issue for two and a half years, ChatGPT released upended, uh, um, upended the way almost all companies plan for their future. So this is definitely the case. If you know, you'd be sticking your head in the sand if you said AI is not impacting hiring. 
However, I don't think it's quite as bad as everybody's saying, but it has really compounded this problem where the degrees are slowly going away. So this is another article, why your day in science degree is becoming worthless and what companies actually want, right? So the uncomfortable truth about your degree. Here's something that nobody wants to tell you. 26% of data science jobs postings don't even require a degree anymore. Let that sink in for a minute. So the guy who goes out and learns how to use AI really efficiently, who becomes an expert at prompt, who learns how to hook everything up using MCP, who learns about functions, who has the latest knowledge on what the latest model is, that guy is going to actually get hired right now faster than the guy with a four-year degree or even, heaven forbid, into a master's or PhD. So the harsh reality is that many data science programs focus more on theoretical concepts and principles rather than practical skills. That's the problem that we're seeing here with data scientists, right? And so that's one of the problems we're seeing with that. So the real challenge is finding people who can gather data, prepare it, cleanse, and put their models into production. We're talking about professionals who understand how to query and connect to databases, implement object stores. So again, see almost nothing here in this list is theoretical. This is all very practical, real hands-on. And here's some great information about some of our services. Hi, I'm Spencer, a fractional CTO. With over a decade of executive leadership and 25 years in software development, I've transformed technology teams and products for businesses just like yours. As you are fractional CTO, you get the strategic guidance of a seasoned technology executive without the full-time commitment. Perfect for companies ready to leverage cutting edge technology without expanding headcount. My team at Startup Hack has already built advanced AI agents for small and medium businesses, automating complex workflows and delivering advanced ROI to human workflows. We specialize in creating custom software that connects your systems into a single coherent technology ecosystem. Our development approach focuses on tangible business outcomes. For one client, we developed AI powered workflows that cut days off of human processes. For another company, by connecting multiple systems, we reduce processing time to increase their ROI by over 75%. We don't don't just write code, we architect solutions that scale. Whether you need cloud system architecture, data integration between legacy systems, or custom AI agents that automate your unique business processes, my team delivers results that exceed your expectations. Having led technology for a lot of companies and launched seven successful brands of my own, I bring battle-tested expertise to your business challenges. Our specialty is turning technological complexity into business advantage. So if you're ready to harness the power of AI and custom software to drive your business forward, let's connect Together, we'll build technology that doesn't just solve today's problems, it positions you for tomorrow's opportunities. Technology leadership, decades of experience, AI powered. Reach out today and we can help you. Check out startuppack.com Spencer.